Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another charging test. So what I did right now is I preconditioned my battery to another supercharger and I came to the same on the on the run EV charger that uh, has limited free charging which uses CCS. Um, but yeah, like uh, this time I'm trying to do it without a cold charge. So without even, um, last time I did that, uh, I, I can link the video up here on the right, on the top right. If you do that, you get low, slow charging rates. Uh, but uh, yeah, with the CCS, uh, I think I should be getting more than 100 kilowatt because this is 150, I think, kilowatt uh, CCS adapter. So if you're interested to know how long I char um, I preconditioned the car, uh, I can show you right here. So it's actually right around 30 minutes. I'm going to pause it right now because uh, I'm just going to end my supercharging here or preconditioning for superchargers. And yeah, I heated the cabin for around eight minutes, just around the house, and it took me around 30 minutes to drive here. So I set it up for preconditioning when I left. So there you go. Yeah, so we'll plug in right now and we'll see how it does. But before that, please don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel, it'll help me a lot. Um, your subscription is very much appreciated. It'll help me boost my channel and uh, get lots of uh, more viewers. So thank you very much for doing that. And uh, okay, so let's plug in right now and we'll see how it goes. So I plugged in right now. I'm just going to set my, uh, go to the app and hit start charging. And then we can see the speed that we're getting. Here we go. We're up to 65, 77, 84, 88 kilowatts, 95, 102, 109, 116, 124, 127. Wow, there we go. So yeah, if you haven't seen my other video, I'll link it up on the top right. And uh, with the cold charging, I was at even lower than this uh, 30 percent uh, battery state of charge I was like around 17 or 18 percent and I was only pulling around 70 kilowatt so now we're almost doing double just by hitting the super uh, by the hitting the preconditioning uh, through uh, any of the Tesla superchargers on the way driving here so there we go there's a there's a nice tip for you folks if uh, if you're a CCS adapter charger that is nearby that can't be uh, preconditioned on the way so this is a kind of a workaround so yeah thank you very much for watching and uh, I'll probably just charge for a bit over here and I'll head back home uh, I'm not gonna stay long I'm sure there's a lot of folks that want to use this charger on the week on the weekend so uh, yeah thank you very much for watching and have a nice day